Hey everyone, welcome back to The Medium. After a super sad part, <laughs> honestly, I'm so shook. I'm so shook up by that last um, trip down memory lane, to put it lightly. Um, I am kind of cautious now to see what else this game is going to throw at us because we're only so far in the beginning. I think we're about halfway through now. I'm going to try and make the episode not two hours long this time. I'm going to aim for an hour to 90 minutes. Hopefully I can stick to that because <laughs> I keep recording too long and I'm kind of stretching myself a little bit too thin. So we're, we have to take it a little bit slower, tiny bit. 90 minutes, an hour to 90 minutes should be a good length still. It's almost still a movie length episode, so I think that should be fair. So we're going to try and aim for that. Um, I'm wearing the shirt that I mentioned last episode with the moth uh, design. So this is from my friend Susie's store, Mortimer from Game Grumps. Um, so I really like this design. There's also like a huge skull and wings on the back, but I can't really show them off properly. But um, if you like this, I'll definitely put a link in the video's description. So definitely check out her store because it's all really cool, really cool stuff. I think I already plugged it, but I am really proud of her and it's really cool stuff. So I'm going to plug it twice. There you go. Um, but for now, we are going to continue on uh, with the medium. We're going to hopefully learn more about the Red House, as the inner demon called it that we fought. So let's see what we can learn. Back in this gorgeous game. Gorgeous visuals. I really like it. This game really is right up my alley. Should turn the volume up again. I always turn it down for Stardew. <laughs> Ooh, what is this area? Those trees seem super tall. Wouldn't it be fucking amazing to be able to walk through an area, abandoned area like this? I would really enjoy that. Reclaiming history. A late 19th century fort of a great historical significance will soon be renovated and reopened to the public. The works are expected to start next year and last until 1983. Can I look through the thingy? Oh. Is that a bird? There's a lantern back there. I can't zoom though. Oh! Ah, Weird. that must be a little nod to the Blair Witch game that they did. Um, someone else pointed out in the comments the first episode went up today that the book 1984 was a nod to Observer, was it? Because that's where you can also find the book, that game. Also, I've been getting some Polish lessons in the comments and W is pronounced as a V, so... From that, I I think I should be pronouncing it as Niva. Do you guys agree with that? Niva or Niva? I don't know. My darling, have I ever mentioned that Mr. Reko Rekovic's daughter, Lilian? Have I ever mentioned Mr. Rekovic's daughter, Lilian? She turned 16 today. Poor thing couldn't even have a proper birthday because of that sickness she's got. Sickness? Anyway, it reminded me of our Anna. Hers is next month, isn't it? Wish I could be there, but Mr. Rekovich needs me here. Gotta stay. Gotta help him out, like he helped me. I love you. F. We keep finding these, don't we? Yeah, it's, it's always F. Okay. It's always F writing to his darling. Or her darling. Educational trail. Nature park. Ooh, nature. Ooh. Um, the Niva na na Nature Park was created thanks to the generosity of the government of the Polish People's Republic. Okay. Let's have a look-see. Maybe we can find a red house in the park. <laughs> also, so many people pointed out that you could it hear. Sounded familiar somehow. Something from my early childhood, maybe. Mm. Was it even a place, 
or something else entirely. I wonder if we're gonna get like a Silent Hill thing where like part of her personality was split and born into a new person. Um, and that's why she has a connection to this place or something. What was I gonna say? Fuck. Um, let's go to the exhibit first. I was gonna say something. Shit. No, I completely lost my train of thought. Oh yeah! That was it. People said that- people pointed out that in the first in episode, the intro, you can hear Sean screaming downstairs because he was recording Little Nightmares. And he was very loud, but I was like, I'm not sure if this mic picks it up or not, so I'm just gonna ignore it. And then if people don't hear it, then that's fine. And if they do, well then, no, whatever. <laughs> but yeah, you can definitely hear him like two minutes in. Wait, if this path continues, then what is- did I just have two ways about it? Also, I completely forgot, but the music is done by the dude who did who did the music for Silent Hill. So that's why it sounds so good. My dearest, it's getting harder and harder to ignore it. Worst of all, it's all starting to make sense. That girl, that poor girl, locked up like an animal. No child should live like this. Is she really that sick? Mr. Rekovic says it's for her own good, but I'm starting to wonder. I wish I could see you again. I love you so much. Is he talking about Lily? Ah, okay. So there were just two ways to go about it. Now that I, now that I know that about the music, I'm like, oh fuck yeah, it's so recognizable. Why didn't I even think about that? Did you guys hear that there's rumors of multiple Silent Hill games in development? Um, like Konami outsourced it, so it's not Konami doing it personally. They're just publishing. But still, I will. I will keep my hopes up, but. I won't really believe it until I actually see something. Like a trailer or some some development journal. Anything here? Mm. Nice camera angle. It's so subtle though. I feel like it's like the Silent Hill music director, but he's like toned down to like 20%. <laughs> that a horse? Oh dear. Another one. It looks like it rotted from the inside. Or there's just a wound on the bottom side that you can't see. Let's not jump to conclusions now. <laughs> Good vibes. Oh, another one. Oh, okay. Yeah, now it definitely. Animals, they look used up. Like something sucked the life out of them. Oh, interesting. Okay. Wolves. Doggy? You gonna make a friend? <gasps> you scared the shit out of me, little buddy. <laughs> oh, he a good boy. What you got there? What's going on with this fur, though? It's like super layered. Oh, hey! Wait! Do you think this shoe is gonna scream again? <laughs> the dog is doing like reverse psychology. <laughs> and he's like, here's a shoe, follow the scent. <laughs> 
the river and a camping spot. He's like, what's the matter? Nose don't work. Ha so, ha. There I was. <laughs> following my new best friend. New best Hoping friend. He wasn't as lost as I was. I remember thinking he could lead me to his owner. In a way. I guess he did. Oh. Wait, why do I feel like it's a dog from Blair Witch? The Blair Witch game. This is like an Easter egg section or anything? Shaving tools, towels, grease, everything an elegant Sasquatch needs. <laughs> What's wrong, buddy? Oh, let's see what we got here. Dog food. Yummy. Treats? There you go. Eat up, champ. What a well-behaved dog that he didn't just snatch that off the counter top, table top. You like that? Can I pet you? What nope. is it, boy? Let's Wanna go! Show me something? You catch a scent? Hey! <laughs> He's like, hurry up! Anyone in there? Oh, this is creepy. What's wrong, boy? I would be terrified. Is someone in there? That sounds like someone laughing. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Uh, well, I wish I could see you again. I miss you so much. Careful now. Why did I stay? Why did I let it out? Francis F. Dead. Shouldn't be. Hey. <laughs> you alright in there? You shouldn't be. I can see you. And that means it. it can see you too. I hope the tent's empty. I hope the tent's empty. I hope the tent's empty. That would be cool. Ugh. No, it's not empty. Oh, did the doggy's owner die? Oh, of course. What else did you expect, Marianne? Ooh, what the fuck? Oh, that's creepy. I think that's him. After they closed down the resort, did he just stay behind? What is Wait. it, boy? Was he your friend? All the faces are scratched out. Do you think the whole staff has died except for him? Well, now he's dead too, but... All I wanted was for her to see the sun. Wait, so he released something? He looks... drained. Rotted out from within. Ooh. Just like those animals I saw. Like earlier. some virus got it. Creepy. That's so creepy that we were what talking to him. What is it? I love how we're best friends immediately. And she's just like, what is it, boy? It's that thing again. It followed you outside? No! Stay! Oh, that dog better run. The ma wore him? What are you gonna do with a stick, girl? Just jump over the fence and roll. Oh, you're gonna- you're so gonna go down that cliff. No. Yes. Go, go, go. 
Time to run, time to run, time to run. Time to run. Oh, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, okay. What the fuck am I doing? Oh shit! Holy fuck! Okay, now we're here. Are those legs? Those are legs. Those are legs. Oh Jesus. I'm running. I'm running. You can't stop me. <laughs> holy shit, holy shit. Ah. No, 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 no! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Oh shit, shit. Dude, you're in the way. I can't see. I can't see. Okay. Tree, tree. Trees are falling. Oh my god. Uh, okay, right. Holy shit. I'm out. I'm out. Dude, I'm out. I'm gonna leave you. I don't like you. Ooh, you better run! Did I lose oh. it? Is it gone? Let's take a breather, shall we? Jesus Christ. <laughs> that was a little bit too much. Okay. That was awesome. How it went like between two versions. It's very stressful, but very awesome. Uh, okay. Let's chill for a sec, shall we? Let's like take some deep bre deep breaths. Pretend like the world isn't fucked. You gotta do a balance act. What do I do? Uh, oh, oh, dad? What? Who's there? You don't recognize your own dad. I recognize them instantly. You promise. Promise what? No risk. Oh shit. This isn't real. It can't be. Maybe Jack had powers too. Jack? Oh. Let me just check here first though. Seems like he came from here. Is that <gasps> his tie? No. How it can't be. How did that get here? The fuck? Someone put that there to throw me off? Maybe someone's toying with me. I mean, we still don't really know what Thomas's intentions are. Wait, what if it's just the Ma pretending to be Jack? I don't know if we can do that, but... Because we already You're helped him. him. Yeah. You're not him. We already helped him move on, so... It couldn't be him, could it? Ooh, I saw that shadow. I saw that. Where have you sent me? Jesus, that was close. I... I've helped you pass on. <gasps> what if she thinks she's helping people pass on, but in reality all she's been doing is sending them to some kind of fucking lonely place? What if she thinks she has a good power, but she doesn't at all? She's only condemning I people. Be here, that would fucking suck. Is that all? No. It's all it. your fault. Nah, Dad? that can't be, Dad. It's too late, Marianne. It's all over. Creepy, creepy, creepy. It all ends. All ends here. No. What the hell? 
someone tricking oh he disappeared from the picture someone like making me hallucinate or something someone hacked into my mainframe Oh, is that the ma? Oh god. Oh my god. Um oh god, what am I doing? I have no idea. I have no idea. What am I doing? Pull it. Does that work at all? Move your ass. Where to? I don't fucking know. What am I doing? Take a break. Take a breather. If I pull it further... Oh, do I still have to- yeah! Choop. Chip. Choop. Okay. We got this. We're brave. We're brave girls. going like where are we what is this building what's this a generator hmm wonder if it still works let's find out of course it doesn't <laughs> I think it's out of gas okay locked down tight I think there's a lever missing Okay, lever and gas. Gotcha. I can do that. It's not, although it's like, it kind of has Silent Hill vibes, the music. I think it's not, it's not a hundred percent. Like, you know how during cutscenes, like, that chill, like, beat kicks in with some melody next to it? It's not exactly going full hardcore like that, you know? Come on, Bolt. Don't fail me now. Fuck! That was loud. <laughs> Fuck. I saw a little interactable there. Maybe I can go around it? No. I thought I saw something. Wait. Check my, my tingly sense. Hmm, no. Must have been my imagination. Excuse me. Where? Where? What? Oh, he's down there. I can hear you up there. Ooh. Oh, is he gonna knock it out over? Oh god, keep going, keep going. He's gonna knock this down, isn't he? Okay, I'm actually balancing this. I'm like Steering right and left, not just forward. <laughs> Fuck. Jesus. Go. Oh. Oh shit. Oh god. Oh god. Dude, yeah, get the fuck out of here, please. He heard the birds. Oh, 
Where is he? Where are you out? Dude, go. Move. Why isn't he moving? He's like right there where I want to be. Oh, oh, oh. How about, what am I going to do? Go, go, go. Go, 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 go. <laughs> what a dumbass. <laughs> I tricked him. There. Take that. That's my way out. Okay, cool. Not with that thing in my way. Yeah, what if I've been sending people here this whole time? Okay. I think he's just trying to mess with me. At least this could come in handy. Wait, what is this? Is this a it's a weird head for a screwdriver, isn't it? Not something I'm familiar with. Ooh. What the fuck was that? I'm out. I'm out. You can't touch me. I'm almost back at the generator. Oh! Is that the does that count as a lever? That screwdriver thing? Let's go, boys! I did it! Okay, I'll put the gas in first. Done. Cool. Fits. Okay, now what am I doing with okay. this? Yeah, what, what am I doing? <laughs> like, what is this for? There you are. Okay. You're still down there. Uh huh. Let's do something about it. Well, what are we gonna do? Ugh, he sounds so close. Shut your fucking mouth! <laughs> Do we electrify him? Yes! Burn, you twisted fucking bitch! I like your language. I like your thought pattern. It's very close to mine. God, I hope this is over. I... I heart... I doubt you can actually kill that thing. I don't know why the frame... Why it kind of stuttered there, the game, but... We're good now. So far, it's running great on the Xbox. I like it. I'm glad I'm finally using my Xbox or something. I mean, I played um, Assassin's Creed Valhalla on it a good 50, 60 hours, but that wasn't officially next gen, you know? And then I did Alice Madness Returns, which was great, but also not exactly next gen. What is that? Sounds like. Ooh, playground? Uh. Oh, do you think Sadness is here? <gasps> she is! Look at that. I thought I left her behind. Sadness? Sadness, is that you? Ask her about the Red House. Oh. Hi, Marianne. Did you find what you were looking for? I was Not hoping you could tell me. Hmm. Sadness? I need you to focus. Think back to as far as you can remember. 
What do you see? Is this a game? <sighs> I'm afraid not, hon. This is important. Listen. I know what Richard did. <laughs> Was he the one keeping you here? Marianne! It's okay. I've sent him away. He's gone forever. Lily. <laughs> Lily? Lily. That used to be your name. Do you remember? All that's happened. Your father. You remember him? Uh, I remember. Ooh. Mommy. Oh, she was so pretty. But, but so sad. Just like you. Hmm. It must be nice to remember your mommy. I never met my parents. There might they, be some connection between them. They... We were in an accident when I was very little. I was the only one who made it. It was really lonely without them. I... Uh, I know what that's like. Ever since my friends, this is a lonely place, Marianne. <gasps> she took her mask off. I shouldn't be here. Maybe you'd be better off somewhere else. Maybe I could send me away. <sighs> no, Marianne. I can't leave. Hmm. Not yet. She has work to do? But why? Aren't you afraid? Of the monster? There's a massive dude back there. In the corner there. I, am. I didn't but see him before. It doesn't need me anymore. It, it wants you. And when, when it breaks you, when it puts you on, it, it'll finally be able to leave this place. But it, it will never be full. It will never stop killing. Then let me send you away. So we can both leave. Now that you remember who you are, I can... No, Marianne. It's not just about me. It's you. You have to remember the dream, the fire, the red house. Hmm. That was here? What? This is where I got my burns. What? what is the red house? You were there, Marianne. With me. Oh. You were always with me. There is some connection. I'm so sorry. Lily? <sighs> hmm. Oh, shit. So what is the Red House? Maybe we can find something. Gone. Just when I thought I could finally send her away. Thomas? I really hope you're still out here. Because I'm running out of options. I don't really know if Thomas is a good guy anymore, honestly. The spark's too weak to absorb. Okay. It's like it's missing something. No, well, let's find out what it is. Are you looking for this little girl? Um, I'm sorry, but, um, father doesn't like it when I talk to strangers. Smart man. He's the manager around here, right? Would you happen to know where he is? I'd love to have a word with him. Go away! 
or I'll scream. That sounds shady. Clever girl. Clever girl. Ooh, what's that? Thomas. Something upstairs. You were here. This was your place. Hmm. A doll? Okay. Why whispers? Oh, it's the suitcase itself. Well, you're one to talk. This was your bright idea. No, they're already on to us. That son of a bitch is one of them. I can feel it. Fine, we'll make sure. Come on. It's almost on. One of them? Who are you running from, Thomas? Mm -hmm. What's going on? What the hell happened here? July 27th, 1983. The Gemini case. The investigation is moving along, but I think Rekovich is starting to suspect something. Need to move fast. Tonight's the night. So they knew about Thomas. But how much exactly? And they were invest. Oh, fuck. They were investigating him? Stuck. Power's out. Okay, so how do I get up there? Um, let's go out here first. Have a look. Ooh. This looks really evil. Oh, oh god. Okay. The spirit of this place. It never stopped burning. Oh, I can't go in. Okay. Mm, I'm running out of time. Okay. Is there a ladder here somewhere? Oh, hey. A Yona. Someone's got good taste. Yunak. Is that a Polish brand? Can I climb this? No. Hmm. How do I get to the generator upstairs? I can go in here. Maybe I can kick down a ladder or something. Okay, that's where my energy thing goes. Oh, that's the generator. Okay, so I just need to find an energy burst and then I can... Then I can get that going. Okay, so... Where are we gonna find that? What's this? Oh, that's just the interactable. From the other side of the fence. And we're back here. Okay. Huh. Such cool puzzles. I really like it. There we go. Okay. That got the generator going. 
Recharge your juice. The thing's unstable. I can't keep it running for too long. Oh, really? Okay. Well, what if then I stay here? You go do it. Now I'm speaking to my spirit self as if it's a different person. I go do it and then as soon as I turn it on, I come back. And that should do it. What does this do? Why do we need this? Oh, I just need it to be out of the way. Ooh. Jack handle. Hydraulic jack handle. Okay. Where do I use that? This looks like it could lift uh -huh. a pound or two. Huh. It's missing a handle, though. Well, what do you know? I just happen to have one. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Good, good, good. I'll take a big sippy. What's this? The red house? Hmm. It was then I knew. This was the place. The answers um, were right in front of me. Got some memories together, Buried huh? Among the ashes. There's gotta be something left. You think you're tough? When you hear them squeal and you smell their bodies burning, you'll tell me everything. You beg me to listen. God. There were children inside. Was she? Was I? I mean, it would match with your burns. You're so special. You burn just like the rest of us. Oh. Who the fuck is that guy? Wait. What if he tried to do like an X-Men like house of for gifted children? Maybe all of the kids inside were had powers of some kind. Like Thomas was trying to be a mentor for all of these kids with similar powers. And then people came to look into it and burned everything down for fear of their powers. Hmm. Okay, so I can't go in there at all. What have I not looked at yet? don't see a trail or anything. Maybe there's a trail going from that memory. The other one. Oh! What's that? A lighter? <gasps> Ooh! Memory time? There's Thomas. Okay, let's see who you really are. You fuck. Locked up tight, huh? You wanna give it a go? Be my guest. Nah, this one's all yours. I like to think I'm more of the brains of the operation. Hey, I got an idea. Why don't we? <coughs> 
Or that. Yeah, that'll work too, I guess. <laughs> right. Top secret. What do we have here? Must be important. It turns out it's, it's his D&D files. I knew he was trouble. Is Sabat like a Polish cigarette brand? Security service. That's no way to talk about a government agent, comrade. Mm, Henry. Oh, he got interrogated. Wake up, comrade. <laughs> Socialism ain't gonna build itself. You don't know who you're messing with, kid. Oh, but I do. I've spent a lot of time getting to know you, Thomas. In fact, you're kind of a pet project of mine. Oh, yeah? What's my speedo size? <laughs> <laughs> Funny guy. Oh, Stanley's I love. love this one. You like it too, comrade? Fuck you. <laughs> Let's play a game. It's called What Makes Thomas Tick. So, the Nazis found you in Warsaw when you were, what, three years old? Oh, they were gonna kill you, but they didn't. No, they saw your potential and wanted to harness it. Mm. But then. The war's over. In comes the heroic Red Army. And... They locked me up for years. Fucking savages. Hmm. <laughs> they do important scientific research. Find out what it is that makes you... Special. Is he gonna punch me with and that? What is that exactly? Ask your mom. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Yep. You enjoy it, don't you? Uh, hurting people like those scientists. <sighs> what were you? Eighteen. <laughs> I saw the photographs. I know how to make a man hurt, but I gotta say, I wasn't impressed. Stick around. I'll give you a live demonstration. And there you were. Free at last, but always on the run. And look at you. You almost made it. But you had to use this power of yours again. And on who? On your... Best mm. friend Richard. You had it coming. Yes. I know you want a revenge. I understand. I would do anything for my child too. Whatever it takes. So he didn't use his powers until Leave then. My children out of this. Children. Yes. My children, plural. How much pain would you endure to keep them safe? He's my dad. Boogie, boogie, boogie. for them? Your freedom, maybe? Let me go, you piece of shit. That's what I thought. So I'll Lily didn't go. survive the fire, but I did. But first, I want you to tell me all about these powers of yours. Then earn it! Come on! Enough of this sissy shit! Hit me! I thought you'd never ask. <sighs> Get some rest, Thomas. The next time you wake up, the real pain begins. Hmm. My guess right now is that Henry found out because Thomas used his powers on Richard. Wake up, sleepyhead. Time's running out. What did you do? Here, 
Oh shit. And then he did that. going in his mind so now we're going in Henry I'm wondering now when Thomas Fuck called him, us finally I thought he'd never give us a chance okay gotta move fast Ooh. thankfully this place has a way of messing with the time flow I still that is cool because he's an agent, so he's all about knowledge. So he's the file cabinets. Old That's awesome. No play, are you, Henry? Okay. Right. Okay, so. Now we know Thomas was being held captive by the Russians because he had powers. He broke out when he was 18. Then he was on the run, didn't use his powers, he was hiding. But then the stuff with Richard happened, so he used his powers. And secret agency, whatever, Henry is with, secret service, probably had a file on him, knew the kind of like way he killed, saw the Richard's body, or found out about Richard, so they honed in on him, found him again. Found out that he has kids, so they burned the house to kill the kids. And I think because now we know that Thomas is speaking in plurals that it was probably Lily and me, so sisters. When we got the call from Thomas, that's what I wanted to say, in the very beginning, I just assumed he was alive, but maybe he just called us from this world. Maybe Spirit Thomas called us and he isn't alive at all, he died a long time ago. Maybe he turned into the Ma, maybe Ma is dad. But that's just speculations at this point. Let's see what makes you tick. I'm very into it. I like it. Can we? No way across. Guess I'll just make my own. Move objects. The fuck is that sound? Holy Fuck. shit. I'm not alone in here. Huh? No, you're not. I mean, his spirit has to be in here, right? So That was a big boy. Looked like a dog. Well, let's get going. Ooh, I love these big monsters. So cool. I feel like someone's gonna hear all of that, though. Just saying. Nothing yet. These sounds are definitely Silent Hill like. Uh, uh, uh. I feel like he's he's very toned down though. I wish he was a little bit more more crazy sounds. Go for it. Go nuts. Very uh, subdued, that's the word. There you are. At least the part of you I'm after. Hmm. Butcher. Jacob Wilk, or Jakob, I guess. Henry Wilk, investigator. Oh, here! I put it in here! Oh! Do you know why 
why you're here. I'm not playing your games, Henry. <laughs> Don't call me that. Is the Henry the Ma? led to believe you've been stealing meat from the working people of the Republic. Where would they get that idea, I wonder? <laughs> you've been a very bad boy. Let's just get this over with. Given your line of work, you had ample opportunity to commit your crime. It is a crime against the people. Punishable by death. Anything to say in your defense? I'm sorry, Henry. <laughs> Hmm. Ooh. Ooh, this is cool. This looks so cool. God, I love it. I love how unique each mind mind palace. It's called a mind palace. Is um Richard Richard was awful, obviously, but his seemed a lot more innocent. This one just seems like pure hellscape. <laughs> His was like wrapped up in like sad memories with the rose garden and the Jewish girl. He's like tiny arms. Did you see that? I thought he was like a T-Rex for a second. Looks so cool. I wonder if we're gonna get like a close-up of it or some interaction with it. Maybe we need to like run as it like slams its hands down or something. God, look how cool this looks visually, though. I mean, oh, shit. ah, fuck. I should have known it's Bluebird. Like, yeah, I might not have really loved their previous games, but visually, it was always very impressive. Always. Ration stamps, meat. Are we getting closer to the butcher? He's butchering a pig? Okay. Oh, we can hear the chains rattling. Never mind! Never mind! I changed my mind! Oh god. How am I gonna get through this? Go. Go. <gasps> oh. Okay, how do I... Do I blow this up? Oh, I need energy. To wait for the. Don't you hide from me! Oh shit! Oh god! What there am I gonna do? You are. Shit! Okay, I don't know what that did, but now I'm past it. I think that kills me if I wait too long. Go. see what it is but Bad boy! I feel like it just comes on when I walk out where are you boy yeah Okay. Ooh. 
I just made it. I got lucky there. Okay. What's over here? Sad piggies. So the butcher, it sounded like the butcher was a guy that Henry framed. Or something. Okay, yeah, if you just, just look at this shot, you could definitely be like, this is a new Silent Hill game in development. People would be like, wow! <laughs> I can see it, the metal, the red. His suitcase again. Huh. Steady hand, even motions against the grain, always against, never with, always against. We got energy from that. Cool. So he was practicing. Oh god. I was just running. Is it here as well? Where am I going? Oh, we're just back down here now. Oh, I see. Now we can blow this open. Big spirit bomb! This feels so Silent Hill now that I think about it. In a good way. Like, I'm not saying it's unoriginally or anything. It's so, it, this, so far, I think this is very original. It makes me kind of think of the movie Cell. Was that with Jennifer Lopez? Ah, we're back here again. Good. Mm -hmm. That's good. See how easy it is when you do as you're told. Oh. Oh, we can just go through now. Patriotism stronger than blood. Not often do we see patriotism of such good quality as it was displayed during these past weeks by senior constable Henry Wilk. Simple officer of the civic police, Wilk showed his commitment to building a righteous tomorrow of the People's Republic by rejecting the shackles of his criminal kinship. His daring investigation into the now infamous meat scandal led to a number of arrests, including one Jacob Wilk, Henry's own father. The butcher is his own father. The irregularities uncovered by Officer Wilk included corruption, theft of high-quality meat products, and replacing them for lesser ones. Apart from Jacob Wilk, numerous other culprits have been apprehended, including four directors of the socialized meat trade and several store managers. Trial is to commence this morning, Thursday, this coming Thursday, and if the accused are found guilty of their crimes, they will most likely face execution by hanging. When asked for comment, Officer Henry Wilk's response was simple, simple, I only did what felt just, truly the words of a patriot. Oh, that's his face on the right there. Security service identity card. Oh, 
Oh, security service, not secret service. Okay, so I'm getting some more context here. Hmm. You want me to feel sorry for you, Henry? Let's see how that works out. I don't really feel sorry for him for snitching out his own dad. What else can I do? We see it's in this drawer, but I don't know how to get it. Oh! Right. I have to highlight it and then I can grab it. Gotcha. I knew, I knew it was there, I just forgot the steps. Vilk, is it? Henry Vilk? Vilk? What's this about? Or the V? <laughs> Straight to the point. No fear, no hesitation. If you wanted me dead, I'd be dead already. So, what do you want? I want to offer you a job. I'm listening. I've been doing this a long time. I've come to know people. See what makes them tick. See their potential. Agreed. On one condition. Huh? The work I do for you, it stays at work. That's the way we like it. It has to. If it doesn't, I'm holding you accountable. Welcome to the family. Okay, that didn't add much. I guess it just tells us that he got the job at... Not Secret Service. Security Service? After he ratted out his dad? He's a true patriot, in their words. Can you imagine your mind being this much of a mess? <laughs> I wonder what my mind palace would look like. If I had to visualize one. I guess file cabinets make sense. Like where you store your memories. We're not in the butcher area anymore. That is an amazing sound. Holy shit. That was the coolest creature sound. What a massive area as well to get through. Like how how do you even find someone in here? I guess we are continuously going up. That's one thing. Have you ever heard of Neva? It is Neva. Oh yeah, during the cutscene I wanted to say I wouldn't it, wouldn't it have been cool if they actually just all were Polish vo voice actors. I'm not saying the the English ones are great. Like they're very nice to listen to and they're not annoying at all, but because it's takes place in Poland, it would have been so cool if it was Polish. To me, at least, because I like listening to other languages. I feel like that would have been awesome. Special assignment for Vilk. A person of interest has been found at the Neva Workers Resort near Krakow. Local investigators had reported of, a, reported of a strange case involving the painter. Yeah, Richard. Ah, see? This is how he found out. Person was found alive, but in a vegetative state. Foul play was suspected, but examination didn't show signs of brain trauma. Possible connection to the Gemini case. Consult the something files. Ah, Gemini case. 
Keep it clean, keep it quiet. That's what we've been training you for. I strongly recommend that you acquaint yourself with the Soviet scientist no notes we acquired during something in 1950. You've been granted access to archive entry 1138. This is for your eyes only, Vilk. Dig in. Report to your case officer for further briefing. So, I guessed that right. They had files on him and then when the, the stuff with Richard happened, they found him again. This? Session 42. The subject continues to manifest strong supernatural powers. He claims that another classified another person is talking to him, showing visions. Working theory, suspected connection to something, possibly established as a result of a near-death experience. More tests necessary to confirm the split theory. Split theory. So, Spirit Thomas. Hmm. Another self is talking to him? Wait, but Thomas is a no. Is he gonna come by? Are we gonna see him again? Yeah, 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 there he is! So big! So big! Is he gonna knock some shelves again? Yep. <laughs> 43. Today's session halted prematurely due to an incident in the test chamber. While administering prescribed substances, lead scientist Dr. Something came into skin-to-skin -skin contact with the subject. The subject was promptly hospitalized. Despite showing no signs of physical trauma, he fell into a vegetative state. <sighs> so the doctor touched him that was going to do the experiments on him and then he went into his mind and killed him. So that's probably how he eventually escaped. So he needs to touch someone to enter their mind and make eye contact, it seems. Ooh, that hurt me. Woo, woo, woo. Little hand! Oh, this little hand came in. Digging around. Can you not? I'm trying to read over here? Thank you. At least I think there's gonna be something. I don't see anything. Huh. Wait, 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 wait. Yes! Reminder for today's rescheduled session. Despite increased dosage, the subject remains extremely dangerous and needs to be restrained, both physically and mentally, for the duration of the test. Heightened security measures apply. Okay, found it. Is he gonna be below us? No, 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 no. Keep going. He is, he is, he is! Fuckers everywhere. <laughs> I knew it. Step. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. We did it. We did it. I don't like how big this area is. <laughs> Can I leave, please? Oh, this is a big area. Oh god, we're gonna pull this entire thing? Ooh. Oh, do I have to... Um... Oh, was it supposed to time it on him? I dropped it super early. Oh well. <laughs> Thank god it worked. We got to see his cool little face. Mm, here we go. So far, so good. <laughs> Jesus! Holy fuck, dude. <laughs> How are you so chill? I am strong. I am a strong mofo. Holy shit. 
Maybe just get higher up so those dudes can't get us. That would be nice. Where are you, you four-legged fuck? I keep climbing, but <laughs> I feel like I'm still at ground level. It's like, get me up, please. I need to be higher up. Can't get me up here, can you? Don't, don't get cocky now. He'll get you. We'll fuck you up. There. Got you right where I want it. Ooh, ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bring it down, bring it down. Do it, do it, do it. Ooh. Nice one. Holy shit. Something tells me he's not gonna stay down though. Looks promising. Who this? Mom, Daddy, and me. Ojamashimas. <laughs> Hello. We're going away tonight. Uh. Business trip. Short notice. Couldn't be helped. <laughs> she doesn't care. That must have been a lovely relationship. Say goodbye to him. I'm not sure if that's a good idea. Son is in a wheelchair. Work on my mind. I see. And again, maybe I should. Do you think I should? Whatever you wish, dear. Simon, where are you, boy? Hmm. Oh. Dad? Neither. Is it gonna move? Are you going away again? Daddy has to go to work. Once I get back, I can go fishing. You'd like that, wouldn't you? I don't like it when you go. I know. But sometimes Daddy needs to work. It's good for all of us. You understand, don't you? I don't wonder why he was in a wheelchair. I... Yes, father. Oh, this is so good. I love it. Red means danger. Uh-huh. Don't worry, kid. This will all be over soon. Ooh. Is this his, ca his castle? I don't think my mind palace would be a castle. I, it's probably something nicer. Something like warm and cozy. Maybe like a cottage. But then on the inside it's really big. Ding dong! Visitor! Oh, he's a prisoner here? Wait, he's a prisoner in his own mind. This is it. You made it. You're just in time. For That's what? Right, kid. Just come to me. I'll put an end to it. I'll set you free. No, it won't let us leave. The monster. It's... Don't worry about the monster, kid. I'll deal with it. I'll put it down for good. Not if it puts you down first. What did you say? They're working together. What the hell are you? What's that? What do you find here? A guilty conscience? A vulnerable child behind the monster? It was a trap. Holy shit, that's his actual... What the fuck? Oh no, did he kill him? 
Oh, that's scary. So Henry is Henry is truly evil. Like he is completely fine being evil. He is the evil inner demon. Daddy? I called it. I called it. Sisters. That's why we have the same powers. Lily's my sister. Well, you just learned a lot about your past. And good thing the Ma isn't around, because you were fucking passed out for a while. How are we gonna fight that thing? I remember. It's him. It was always him. Oh shit, he's right there. Oh fuck. What are we gonna do? How the fuck are we gonna- He is not the Ma. I mean, if I was three, you can't really blame me. He doesn't know, so... He wanted to save us! To save her! Maybe... In a way... That's exactly... What he did. This is fucking madness! This place... It reeks of it. Madness. gonna attack me or not. Then it's about time to clean it up. Once and for all. What are you gonna do? He's so fucking big. Oh. Holy shit, Marianne. My father. Boogie woogie woogie. Was he the man on the pier? The man with the gun? The murderer from my dream? Oh yeah, I completely forgot that dream that the game started with. Why? 
I needed to know what happened after the fire. What happened to them? To me. Hmm. <laughs> Did you do it? Nice. You're fucking strong. You're much stronger than I thought. Oh, that's how you found the picture. Surprised that's still okay after so many years. Well, good thing you got rid of Henry. Ooh, oh, I'm so excited to play more, but this is another narration piece was done. So I, I'm guessing, oh, sorry. I'm guessing that that is kind of like another chapter done. For me, at least, this is like the perfect pacing because we keep ending with going back to her in the beginning, narrating her experience going through this. So perfect. Really, really happy with doing it in an hour and a half too. Yay! <laughs> 90 minute episode. So that's perfect. I can't wait to play more of this. I'm honestly loving this so much. I'm really, really into it and I want to know more about the story. I hope you guys are enjoying it too. Um, seems like we're getting like some proper answers now. Now we just want to find out what happened between the house being on fire, Thomas trying to save us, and why Thomas didn't keep me. Because we ended up in the orphanage, so... It must be something with Thomas, either his identity being like compromised so it was safer if I went to an adoption or to um, a foster home. People were still after him so he probably had to hide and get a new identity or something. Um, I'll have to take a look at the first episode again when he calls us and see if that's like... If, he, if there's any hint in his voice that he's not like alive anymore but... It would be fucking awesome if the dad turned out to be still alive and we find him somewhere. What if he's sitting on the other end of the table listening to her story? That would be cool too. I can't wait. We'll find out more in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching all the way to the end. Leave a like if you enjoyed it and I'll see you guys soon with more.